Today we're going to learn how to cut a window mat for presentation of our artwork. So you want to start off by first measuring the size of your artwork that will show through the window. I like to draw out my dimensions on a diagram to keep myself in order. Add four inches to both the length and the height to accommodate the outside border. Cut your mat board to the outside dimensions, including your border. Next, decide if you're going to mat on black or white showing and draw on the opposite side. Make sure the mat cutter is placed on your left side and you're going to adjust the ruler bar to two and one quarter inches. Unscrew the black pegs, adjust, and then tighten them back into place when you're finished. Next, make sure you check your blade for damage. It shouldn't have any nicks or dents in it. You can push down with your thumb and then pull up to put the blade back into place. With the back of the mat board facing you, next you want to slide it underneath the ruler bar and grab a pencil to draw the borders lightly along the outside edge. Make sure to use pencil, drawing all four borders all the way through on all four sides. Once again, if you're matting on black, you should be drawing on white and vice versa. Once you've drawn all four sides, double check your artwork before cutting and make sure that the art is slightly larger than your window to allow for taping. Now place your mat board back under the bar and align the cutting blade with the silver guide line and your pencil line. Hold down the mat board with your opposite hand to keep it in place. Make sure you slow down and stop at the opposite pencil line. Pull up and remove the blade before turning to cut your next side. Repeat the cutting process on all four sides. The center of the window should fall out neatly. Please check corners for any tears or nicks or bends because you will have to recut corners that are not clean. You should now be able to tape your artwork from the back, fitting through the window without any gaps or holes showing. Please flip it over. Make sure your artwork is centered before taping around on all four sides. After taping, flip it over. Make sure your art is centered. Check your corners for cleanliness. If you need to recut, go ahead and do it now. Otherwise, place a backing board on the back and tape around all four sides to secure your artwork and get it ready for presentation.